first video of our second year of YouTubing, guys, and I have made one pretty big change. Here's the reveal. I, I got new skin, which really isn't that big of a reveal, but let's do a little bit of a swivel. Co comment down below if you guys like it. I think my skin turned out pretty darn cool, but what's going on, guys? This is Yomaxer238. Before we start off this video, I just want to thank you guys again so very, very much for my one-year anniversary video, which it did really well. You guys absolutely liked it. I did put a lot of editing, so that's probably why it was so, you know, good and so well done, but I really hope you guys did enjoy that video. If you haven't seen it, go ahead and make sure to check it out because I put so many hours into it but today's video guys I'll be totally honest when when I started recording this I had literally zero ideas on what I was gonna do for this video I had no idea and so what I did instead was this so knowing I wanted to do something build related I went ahead and I went online and to this website called blockpalace.com and I started looking through just a bunch of blog palace just to get some ideas some inspiration on what I should build and I kind of had this idea how cool would it be if using these palettes, I strictly abided by only the blocks in the palette. So what I did was because I wanted this to be random, I didn't want to have to be able to choose one. I just wanted a, some some easy random idea on the fly. So I went over here, I Googled a random list generator creator, something along those lines, and I typed out all these uh, all, all these templates and put them right here in this list. And now I haven't actually done this yet, so I have no idea what's going to happen. But I'm going to press rerun and we'll say quantity one, and we're gonna see which palette we're gonna be using today to build. And it looks like it is the Frontier palette, which if we go over here, is strictly these blocks right here, which, that, that'll be interesting to see. I don't know what I'm gonna do yet, still have no idea. But my video idea is basically using these blocks and kind of variations of these blocks as well. But strictly this palette, I'm gonna do an insane build today. Now with this palette in hand, you guys can see right here, these are the blocks and what I meant by variations is you can use dark oak wood or dark oak logs, that sort of thing, or netherrack or, or nether gold ore. But now that we have got these blocks and these palettes using specifically only these blocks, I'm gonna create a frontier build. If you guys do like this video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe because it always really does help me out. With that said, I think we're just going to go ahead and jump straight into a time lapse and then I'll explain my build afterwards. It's it's probably going to be on the bigger side because I don't have a lot of variation of detail with these blocks, but we'll see what happens. Let's go ahead and jump into a time lapse of my awesome build. My first video of the second year, and oh my gosh, I already got carried away. I will say in comparison to the very first video of my first year, this is a lot, lot better, but what ended up, uh, I was it was only supposed to be about a four or five hour project for this video, right? It turned into about like 10 or 11 hours. I spent so much time building this thing and it looks absolutely amazing though. Just looking at the size of this thing, you can definitely tell that it is one ginormous build. I think the base of it is like 128 blocks and it's almost 140 blocks tall, something crazy like that. And while it's not nearly as ginormous as my mumbo, I, I I don't even remember what it's called, my jumbo build. It is a pretty darn big build and it did take me a very long time, even using world edit. Just standing on top, just watch how long it takes to jump down all the way to the bottom, you ready? If we jump from right there, 
Yeah, that, that definitely took quite a uh, couple seconds just, just jumping from the very top. That's kind of insane. But I think what I want to do now is just to show some before and after comparison pictures. You know, what the scan landscape looked before without the building, what it looks like afterwards. I think that'd be kind of cool. So let's go ahead and just do a few before and after comparisons. And looking at those before and after comparisons, it's almost hard to believe that this entire thing was made using only six blocks. That is just absolutely crazy that I used these six variations of blocks to create the coolest of things, whether it was custom Minecraft tools or this epic sign depicting my name of my own old Western restaurant, creating a little custom fire pit where you can sit by the campfire and roast some marshmallows, or creating these awesome railings that you wouldn't get otherwise in a small Minecraft house. There are just so many cool little details that I got to design during this project, and, and it's just crazy to think that using only six blocks that we created all this stuff. And I do want to clarify too, you guys might have seen me using red sand and that sort of stuff to do the landscape or terracotta, but I don't really consider that part of the build. I was just making the landscape look pretty. So my build was completely made though using only those six blocks that I showed in the palette of the, the frontier palette that I showed in the beginning of this video. But I guess the one last thing we should probably do before this video is over, and I accidentally kind of did make this a little bit shorter, but that does kind of happen when you're video editing the exact same day that you're supposed to release the video. If you guys are watching this the day I released it, the second I released it, I was video editing it just a couple hours ago. But the very last thing I guess we could do is go ahead and have a little bit of a meal, a little bit of a dinner, because this is Mikey's restaurant after all. And it's a frontier old Western restaurant. So let's eat some cake or something along those lines while we go ahead and do one last swivel of this awesome build. But with that swivel now done and done, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe because it really does help me out. But um, with that said, I don't really have much else to say as usual. I, I was a little bit stressed on the video editing, so it wasn't the greatest today because uh, just of time. I, I, I'm, you know, in school and work and everything, I just don't have as much time as I used to when during the summertime. But I hope you guys did enjoy it because I think the video still turned out really cool. Oh, yeah. And if you guys want to download this, I will put it on Planet Minecraft. That's a big thing. Link will be down in the description for that. But with that said, I hope you guys did enjoy. I'll see you in the next video, which whatever that's going to be, I have no idea yet. But um, enjoy playing Minecraft. Enjoy life, guys, as always. And ciao.